Here we have an example with bisected angles where when you bisect an angle, you have two congruent pieces. So in the question, it says in the diagram below, angle EFG is bisected by ray FH. What is the measure of angle EFH? So the key to solving a question like this is recognizing, once again, that bisected means that you have two congruent pieces. So these angles that are pictured here, angle EFH and angle HFG are congruent. First, we need to solve for that missing piece, that x that's in our angle measures. So we have 7x plus 15, and I'm going to set that equal to 2x plus 25. And I can set them equal to each other because they're congruent. Now that we have this set up, we're going to start by solving for x. I'm going to subtract 15 out from both sides. That gives me 7x is equal to 2x plus 10. I'm going to subtract my 2x out from both sides. That gives me 5x is equal to 10. Divide out the 5. x is equal to 2. Now that we know x, we can use that to find our missing angle measure. So we are trying to find the measure of angle E, F, H, which we know is equal to 7 times x, which we now know is 2 plus 15. 7 times 2 is 14. I'm going to add 15 to that, which means that the measure of angle E, F, H is equal to 29 degrees. If you want to check that that is correct, the best option at this point is to take your X and plug it into the other angle measure. So you'd have 2 times 2 is 4, plus 25 is 29. Both angles equal 29 degrees, so you are um, correct in your answer of 29 degrees because both of the congruent angles have the same measure.